The protests we're seeing around Louisville and across the country at the moment are something we've seen before in our history. Wake Up Anchor Kristen Pierce is taking a look at the push for equality then and now as she joins us live downtown. Hey, Kristen. Hey, Doug, during the civil rights movement, men and women marched across the country fighting for equal rights for African Americans. More than 50 years later, people are doing the same thing. We, the black people of this city, want all of our freedom. Those in our area who marched with Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. are now sitting with protesters, whether it's on their front porch. They have picked up where we left off. At Jefferson Square Park. It's time that everybody is treated the same. Or in a motorized wheelchair. I want less than that. They say the fight is the same. There is no difference. We were fighting for justice. We were fighting to be treated right. What do you want to see changed? I want to see it all changed. I want all of it to change. Oh. Freedom. They want to see the end of systemic racism in police departments where black people are more likely to be killed by police, even though they are more likely to be unarmed. Over me. In schools where students of color are suspended at disproportionately higher rates than white students. I'll be buried in my and in the justice system where African Americans are incarcerated at more than five times the rate of white people. No justice! No peace. I don't want this to have to happen again. It's just time now. This is the moment. If we don't get it right now, I don't know if we ever will. So their legs may not be what they used to be. <laughs> and go home. But their fighting spirit remains strong. And be free. The older generation, as they call themselves, are planning a sit-in. That way they can show their support for protesters. They are planning to do that next weekend. When we get details, we will definitely share them with you all. Reporting live in downtown Louisville, Kristen Pierce, WHAS 11 News.